Hello, welcome back to the channel. It's Echo Stretch. In this video, we're going to go ahead and check out Carlos Host on the ESP32 S2 boards. Um, he did go ahead and update it, uh, both bins with the latest Gold Hen uh, 2.1.2. But the one that we're going to go ahead and use, and I've already got it flashed, is the one with the trainers. Um, the main host is updated as well if you want to go ahead and use that. But let's go ahead and just jump right into the video. I will leave links in the description. You can go ahead and download the latest bin. So we'll jump over to our settings. Now you can see that I don't have the goal 10 options. And if we scroll down, I don't have a debug settings. Now we can go into network. I've already went ahead and connected to Carlos host. Um, you can just jump in there and set up internet connection and go through the Wi-Fi. If, if it is your first time, then the password for the host is just one to eight. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, I think everybody can pretty much figure that out. Let's go ahead and back out of here though. Go ahead and launch our browser. Now we'll do the usual, just close the first window and we'll make sure that our frequently used pages is cleared, our browser history is cleared, and then we'll go into our settings and delete our cookies and clear our website data. Now once that's done, there's two ways to go ahead and access the site. You can do it through the user guide just by going over to settings, user guide, and go ahead and select user guide. Or you could just use the browser. It doesn't make a difference, but whichever one you do, it will load up the host. Okay, so once we do start loading, it will start installing the cache. It shouldn't take too long. It seems to be going a percent a second. Um, yeah, as you can see, we're at 20%. Uh, I think when I did go ahead and flash it, it was updated with the latest trainers as of February 18th. So today is the 21st, so three days ago. So it has the most recent trainers. Okay, so we're just about 50% there now. Okay, 60%. 40 more seconds or so. Seems to be going pretty quick though. There we go, 75. Eighty-five. He did do a few updates too. When we do jump in, you'll see that we have uh we have two options. We can go into the trainer page or we can just go into the nine point zero zero page. Um so we'll go ahead and just hit our PlayStation button and close out of the browser and then we'll go ahead and relaunch it. And as you can see now, we do have two different buttons here to go into the PS4 trainer part of it, or we can go in to do the jailbreak. So we're going to go ahead and select 9.0 or 900, and we'll give it a few minutes here just to do the jailbreak and to get us in. Okay, so it's loading the XFAT, so it should come up on supported file system any moment. There we go, and then we should get a jailbreak done. Give it a few seconds and it should come straight through. There we go. So now we can go ahead and select Gold Hen 2.1.2. Go ahead and select it. Okay, and load it. Perfect. So you can go ahead and use the other payloads if you want. If we're going to go ahead and load the trainers, then you'll need WebRTE. But if you're using a tool from a computer or a cell phone, then you might need PS4 Debug. And of course, Orbis's toolbox is there. One of my favorites. It just helps you out if you're going to go ahead and use the computer with PS4 debug. Then you can go ahead and check which title ID your game is. So let's go ahead and click on PS4 Trainer and just get that to load up. Okay, it might take a couple of seconds here for it to load through. Seems to be taking a little longer than usual though. Let's go ahead and just hit our PlayStation button. Okay, and you can see Orbis's toolbox is loaded. Let's jump back in there just to make sure the trainers is working. Yeah, as you can see, it does come up with no issues. Um, but yeah, guys, that's basically it for the video. I just want to jump on, show you that it has been updated with the latest Gold 10. So if you're using an older version, Go ahead and jump on and download the current version. So that way you can be updated with Goal 10 as well as the trainers. But I'm going to leave the video at that. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.